Right, back into the shop. Turn that down. Right, been out and about, it's been a lovely day today. Um, I just pulled into the shop because I wanted to get some snacks for later. Uh, yeah, it's been a lovely day. Um, got a lot done in the garden. I did a video earlier just to show that we do have sun in Devon. Um, but yeah, I didn't do any bonsai today. It was um, it was more tidying up the garden. The usual stuff, the usual stuff that you do when you when you get the opportunity. Because we've had a lot of rain lately. It's been absolutely horrendous. Um, so yeah, been out and about. Been out in the Defender, been up on the moors, um, messing about. It's been quite nice, beautiful sceneries. I took some videos earlier and some photos. <laughs> um, well, I, I thought I did, I didn't. Um, I thought I did a couple of videos, but all I did, I, I didn't have all the video set in. I wasn't, I wasn't really concentrating, I was too busy. Um, mooching about um, so hence why I'm doing this video now because I thought um, there was some beautiful scenery so I went, I went through up the valley road up to the valley um, excuse me um, and then went up onto um, the moors and um, yeah stunning absolutely stunning scenery especially on a a sunny day like today it's been absolutely beautiful um, but as I say I didn't do any photo uh, didn't do any videos mess that up but what I will do is go back because there was one spot that I know quite well and um, it's yeah it's stunning the scenery is stunning so hopefully we'll get another nice day and then I'll do couple of videos or some, or some decent photos the, the, the videos I thought I did and ended up being photos the photos weren't any good because obviously I just thought I was starting a video so I just pushed start and then set up and obviously all I did was take a picture of the ground and I'm pretty sure you guys can see a picture of the ground um, so we'll do that later on um, it's been a lovely day. I've had some fun today, actually. Um, it was nice to get out. Um, although, I like being in the garden, and I like doing stuff. And there was obviously a lot to do. But, um, because the weather's been sort of rubbish lately, I haven't really been out anywhere. So, I thought, let's just get out, get out about. See what's going on. So, yeah, we're on our way home. We're not far from home. Just literally got on the valley road. Um, so we'll we'll plod back. Um, and I've got a video to do later on some indoor bonsais for a change. Um, I've got a load of them that need dealing with. It's not really my thing. Um, they're, they're more succulents than anything. Money plants, memory plants, jades, ficus, the usual suspects. Um, so it's not really my thing, but I keep all plants. So um, I've got a few indoors and they need dealing with, they need pruning back. It's been a crap year for most plants. I know I keep saying that, but it really has. We haven't really had a summer. It hasn't done anything. Um, we've, had, we've had hardly any sun, and it's been wet a lot of the time. So plants that like a lot of sun and relatively dry conditions, they haven't done very well. They've suffered massively. And yeah, the indoor ones definitely um, definitely are, are evidence of that um, so we'll deal with them um, 
I'll deal with them over the next week. I'll only do a couple of videos on a couple of them. Um, so it's not really my thing. Um, I don't really know a lot about um, indoor plants. Um, I know the basics, but I'll say it's not my thing. So yeah, we'll do a video on, I think it's a, well, it's a, a money plant or a memory plant. Apparently some people call them memory plants. Um, which is quite interesting because the, the milk that they produce, apparently, I don't know, don't take my word for it, but I've heard this. The reason why they call them memory plants is because they are actually used in medicine um, to do with memory loss. Alzheimer's. I don't know whether you believe it or not. Um, but yeah, that's why they call the memory plan. Um, and then, yeah, it's basically a, a, a money plan. So we're going to work on that later on. So I say, I just want to get home and have a shower. Um, and we'll set up the expensive studio. Studio Mark 1. known as rears, um, big birds basically, um, they're just up rear on the corner, they, they, they share a field with donkeys and I think there's a Shetland in there, a little Shetland pony, just in here, I'll have to video them one day, they're weird looking things, yeah they're a bit like emus, massive things, yeah there they are, yeah the big old things, big old birds, funny looking things. Yeah, there's, there's the Shetlands over there. Yeah, they're in there. Yeah, so they're funny looking birds. Um, yeah, people say that they're not that intelligent because of the size of their heads. Tiny brains. I don't know, I've, I've walked past there many a time and looked in and there's something going on in their heads. Yeah, there is something going on in their heads. Yeah, they're funny, funny looking eyes, big bulbous eyes. Big thing going, yeah, funny thing. Deer. Oh no, not from round here. So yeah, we're back in the village. Um, and I'll I'll do the video later on. I have got in. And um, settled down. Right, catch you in a bit. <laughs> <laughs> 